hello everyone in this video I'm going to show you how to use future skills prime app first you have to install the app from play store or app store open the app at the bottom of the screen you will see sign up click on that you can sign in sign up using any of these options I'll choose email enter your email ID agree to it agree to terms and conditions click next I should get an email now okay here is the email open it and verify your email confirm your email address if you don't get it scroll down confirm your email address tap on it choose chrome always choose chrome if you don't get chrome also it's fine once you verify it future skills prime app should open up by itself enter your name password your password should be capital letter as well as small letter sorry it should have a capital letter a number and a symbol and minimum of eight characters example this is just an example don't use this password use some other password I'm using this just to show you how your password should look like this is a very common password please don't keep it like this and no one should know your password then I agree next date of birth enter your date of birth do not enter the date of birth that I am showing you okay uh, here is how you have to select your pin code touch pin code tap on pin code search the pin code you want you'll get a list so narrow it down and tap the pin code any pin code you have to tap it from the list see here came came the green mark similarly if I change see there is no green mark here so you have to tap it to select it now this pin code is selected click on done enter your mobile number click next occupation student education undergraduate do not select this one you don't have to select this one click next you can choose any three interests randomly next Now the bottom of the screen you can see groups tab on the right hand bottom right tap that search on top right search campus to corporate search for it join it okay once you join open it again you need to complete these three modules under digital 101 under digital 
101 you don't have to complete workplace skills once again you don't have to complete you don't have to complete workplace skills you just have to complete a digital 101 digital 101 overview module 1 module 2 module 3 after completing all these three modules after completing all these three modules okay all this everything that comes after you open any of those through those three modules after opening those three modules complete those and then you have to attempt the test you get two chances attempt one attempt two if you pass the, pass it in attempt one good if you don't then prepare again properly and then attempt it once again you will have the attempt two is the last chance you have only two chances so attempt two is the last chance whether you have got your certificate or not you will get to know from options from the home screen from the home screen on top left side options and then view profile you'll get badges here and certificates here if you pass the exam it will be shown here and if you have any doubt or if you did not get the process properly if you did not understand the process of or if you are getting stuck somewhere uh, leave it in the comment below uh, and uh, before uh, leaving a comment please check if it's already there if, if the doubt has already been posted by somebody else